Outreach and engagement is a key part of the work the Royal Society of Biology does to showcase the importance of the biosciences and STEM and to engage with as wide a range of audiences as possible. This year, the Bedfordshire, Hertfordshire and Essex branch of the RSB ran a science festival right in the centre of the town of Basildon. Studying biology can be rewarding, but the stereotypes that science is difficult, inaccessible or not for everyone are still prevalent. But here in Basildon, in an effort to reverse that process, they're bringing science to the streets. Events such as this, this science fair here in Basildon, uh, is a great example of what can be done to show young people how exciting science is. With the help of the Royal Society of Biology, Hertfordshire, Bedfordshire and Essex branch, the Street Science Fair is being held in the heart of the town's shopping centre. Now in its fifth year, it's a labour of love for organiser Hevsi Angela Tago. We're bringing the science to the people. They're not having to go out to look for it. The perceptions will not allow them to go to a science museum or to go out to a science festival. But if we're here and you come and engage with us, you see what it's like and hopefully over time some of these perceptions can be done away with. It's about showing the opportunities that STEM education, STEM studies and STEM careers can provide people with. S is for science. T is for technology. E is for engineering. Uh, R is for maths. So there's lots of things that can draw people in, for example a skeleton which is quite visually appealing. We've got a big paddling pool to demonstrate the plastics activity. Um, so lots of things that kind of grab the eye and can get anyone interested. The interest in plastics in the marine environment has grown hugely since the recent Blue Planet came out. Um, and we've actually got an activity today kind of looking at the effect of that plastics can have on marine creatures. So that kind of helps draw people in as it's a really hot topic. So when I'm about 50 years old, um, they say there will be more plastics in the ocean than there will be fish. This popularisation of science is vital for engaging the next generation and something MP Stephen Metcalf takes seriously. Basildon is an extraordinary place. It's got the Enterprise Corridor north of here, uh, 45,000 jobs supported in some of the most innovative and dynamic companies, certainly in the southeast of England, everything from tractor building to making aircraft fly. And we have got to connect those businesses with the source of future employees, i.e. the children who are studying in our schools. When we have a three-day festival that's running on a Thursday, Friday, Saturday, yearly year out in Basildon, and the whole community and um, our leaders of Basildon buying into the whole idea as well. That is what success of Basildon Street Science would look to mean.